Some say conquer now sucks. But I concur. And I will conquer. Conquer. Conquers. Fuck it fails. A game for everyone that does not work. Even though it has nice music and wonderful graphics for Game Boy, excluding the barn, it's still he moves so slow, you might as well keep running, but then enemies everywhere come out of nowhere. They're so cheap and awkward to dodge because they're so big, fast, and the roots are so narrow. They take so long to die by slingshot, and because there's not enough rocks around, you'll almost always be defenseless. The worst are these Damn it! You can never dodge fast enough, even when you follow a certain pattern. You keep firing diagonally away as you try to dodge. Alright, that's it. Finally! What? They immediately regenerate? What's the point of this anyway? You don't score points or anything, you just die! Might as well try to avoid them. Great, now what do I do? This is all very odd because everything else is too- like the puzzles are too simple, moving boxes at the right order, unlocking doors, and being a delivery squirrel. That's basically it. You know, Rare hasn't made that many games, so I'd like to think of this game as a rare piece of is also awkward, and there's not enough acorns to heal damage, so dying is easy, and if you die, it takes 10 hours before you can replay the game. You go all the way back to the non-skippable beginning. Every time you die, this happens. Hurry up. Why does it take so long? Every time you enter a text box, the music annoyingly restarts. There's so many invisible walls, it's like getting lost in an invisible maze, and the perspective is an illusion. Like, how are tree branches above me going to block me? Glitches are everywhere. Like, when you move diagonally against trees, he grows a second tail. They couldn't even give him a diagonal sprite. You're always lost because there's no map. Keep getting stuck. Gameplay is just bland. It's the same thing over and over again. Aimless wandering. Conqueror's bad for a day. Don't be deceived by Conqueror's kitty luck. Now he's badass, and this is not a kid's game. It was going to be, but was replaced with this. What a nutty pile of <laughs> Have both. Feels like Disney. Whoa, settle down, boy. Stop bothering the tree. Now put your nuts away. That was bad. Nevertheless, with beautiful graphics, precise control, charmingly delightful music, and witty, uncensored humor, this game is amazing. You also get drunk, piss, and go to what more needs to be said? You know, Conquer, Dixie, and Tails would make an awesome team. Conquer's other bad fur day, what could have been an awesome game, was cancelled when Nintendo sold Rare to Microsoft and was replaced with Conquer Live and Reloaded. A bad, bad fur day port. Conquer's classic look is so deceivingly awesome. You'd never expect a squirrel so cute and adorable to be so badass. But they ruined him. Now he looks like a hairy wedged inside a squirrel's anus. They tried to make an already badass icon, badass for Xbox, but instead made him bad and ass. Graphics are technically superior, but they replaced the cartoon graphics with ugly, washed out, more realistic ones. Now without any charm, personality, crisp design, and a lot of the good cinematic framing of the classic. The Great Mighty Pooh now looks like because now, he doesn't look like but also now looks like the Voice balloons aren't as readable. A lot of the animation is gone, and what remains now retains far less than wrong emotion. Like, Conquer here looks like an evil genius. But here, he looks like a spoiled brat. And why does he now hold a holy grail? The glass of milk parodied a clockwork orange. They ruined the entire scene and destroyed its meaning of existence. Bastards. Conquer now only has one gun instead of two. 
garbage. Damn it, Rare. Why did you have to leave Nintendo? Game now takes a lot longer to load, which makes sense because the original was cartridge-based, but it's still annoying. Conker's arm floats are now gone. Cartoon blood is now realistic. Deleted classic parts like the eel sequence. Cutscenes are a bit choppy with non-synchronized audio. Some cutscenes aren't as funny. Like, they removed Conker's priceless face when the gargoyle fell off the bridge. Now when you use your weapon, you go to this third-person perspective. It's unnecessary, awkward, disorienting, and I don't like it. You now use a bat instead of a frying pan, which was funnier because it was sillier. They censored most of the swearing because obviously, Xbox is for kiddies and Nintendo is for adults. It doesn't even play the same and is now filled with many bugs. Control is now awkward and Conker slides when he stops like he's on ice. The now awkward camera can't zoom in or out except when Conker gets near a wall. Then it zooms into the back of Conker's head. A real pain in the ass. Stop it! Online sucks, the level design is incredibly stale, badly designed, and the convoluted and messy control is worse than single player. Like almost everything else, it's better on the 64. This game is more depressing than watching a murder of murdering crows getting murdered, and a disgrace to the squirrel's legacy. <laughs> Joe, you're next.